We're having a staring contest. I think I'm winning. Look away. Look away. Oh man. It's getting intense. This is getting real intense. Ah man, I give up. You're too good at this, Mr. Villager. I'm gonna call you Gravel. You're such a rip-off artist. Uh, how you guys doing? I'm doing just fine. Making some baked potatoes. What not. You know. I started our tree farm. It looks pretty sweet. I had a really good idea. And I went with it. I've been working in my creative world. Trying to get a good idea going. So... I have my layout right now and the building's gonna be like this um, I need to figure out if this is gonna be four wide or three wide still um, but it's going to be stone brick on the bottom as far as I know I'm not I haven't really made the whole building yet so but I want to do like stone brick on the bottom and incorporate cobble and stuff something cool I don't know and then I have this great idea for like a lamp post type things but they're almost like sentry towers watchtowers or whatnot kind of like those but smaller and just holding a block of glowstone so we'll have to go to the nether and get some glowstone before we do that. I can probably do that off camera. Um, yeah, this is going to be the design. Um, I just think that looks really cool, like, putting the trees, like, one wide, or not, yeah, whatever, you know what I mean. It's like, it's 2D instead of 3D, almost. And putting that into a wall, and then coming in here, attaching the path, to however we do it and right here is gonna be a doorway that's gonna be too wide so we're gonna pretty much I think just like that yeah nope already messed up yeah so just like this and you're gonna walk in there's gonna be oak trees and then down here I think I'm gonna I don't know where I'm gonna do it yet but I'm either going to do staircases or ladders up and down. Um, I think staircases would be nicer looking and easier, I guess. Um, it wouldn't take as long to get up and down. It's not really going to take long either way. But I have to have one going down and one going up to do what I'm planning to do. Because for these trees, the ceiling has to be eight high. And I don't want to have a building over here that's 24 blocks high, or what I, I think it would be 24 total, or 26 or something, um, counting the floor, but the floor would be the ceiling, so I guess it would be, it would be 24. I don't want to have a 24 high building, but a 16 high building I guess wouldn't be too terrible, and I say that with a slight yeah it would be a little terrible but so either I could go do this up really high or I could just continue just going down um, I never really thought about doing two layers underground but this is pretty much the setup for the tree farm I haven't really done much to it yet um, took a while to get this all laid out and to the point that I was happy with it um, the next thing is I made a big discovery today. I was just digging my way around looking for some redstone for a future project. Um, let me store some stuff. This chest. Let's do that because we're going to keep those. Well, how close are these? Eh, we can use those instead. Let's put the carrots in here. 
we can take those with us down to the mine. The grass and the flower needs to get thrown away. I'll keep the sticks. The shears can go. Um, cobble can stay. Over here, iron pickaxe. We're going to need that. And we're... Oh, there is a workbench. I did a little, just, little work over here to our strip mine area. Um, okay. I added stairs so we can get down a lot faster and we don't have to jump up and waste hunger. Which may not seem like a big deal, but... I wanted to add stairs in so it was a lot easier. Um, there I can't exactly because there's a room above this that's the same exact layout and if I mine these out there's like the floor right here so can't do that unfortunately. I was hoping I could. I mean I could but it would look a little weird so there's that. We got a chest for cobble, got a chest for dirt gravel, flint, I guess, um, some other things, here's redstone and some ore, um, and here's materials. What I want to show you is pretty spectacular. Here's our furnace room for up here. Uh, there's some coal I need to collect, but I just did a little mining because I was looking for redstone, because I was thinking today was going to be the future project. and. I didn't find very much, so I was like, okay, well, you know, I'll just go mine a little bit, and then I'll work on the tree farm. But, right into my mine, we already have at least three diamonds. So, my plan for right now is to mine these guys out and make our first diamond pickaxe. I'm just going to make sure I don't... I want to miss something. I don't think there's any more. Most likely not. So let's do that. But I wanted to make a diamond pickaxe so that we can go and get some obsidian and we can already be on our way to creating another portal. So there's our pickaxe. I hate doing that because I just used all of my diamond on that one pickaxe. Right, dirt goes here keep the 42 um, let's put those there Oops. okay so this area down here is a little a little dangerous I stepped right into some lava earlier I didn't die but I almost died <laughs> and I was not very happy about it okay so gonna do that and what we're gonna do let's go oh right I have to find the source I don't, I don't know. okay so this is safe this is not safe not safe okay so that means the source is up <sighs> oh well we'll go we'll go back up not actually like up to the next level but go back to the village um, anyways so I'm gonna actually leave the diamond pick down here just cause I never know what's gonna happen iron do I need that? I don't really need that right now what did I do? oh right I have all the tools up I can keep that. Whatever. <laughs> so, anyways, that's what I did. I was just working on that off camera and stumbled upon those diamonds and I didn't want to just collect them. Oh no. Oh no. Not again. Not again. Gosh. Let's see. We would not. Oh. So lucky. So lucky. Oh, I like when that happens. It's so nice. Let's see. I think there was a skeleton in here. Oh, that's it. Oh, chicken's dead. Run. No, don't. Villagers. Don't run into the zombies, you 
dummies. Okay, that guy died. What? They're always trying to break a door, and I never know what door it is, and it really bothers me because I can never find it. And for some reason, the villagers never go back here. Which is like the safest house. Dang, guys. I should just like get them all confined before they all die. I feel like most of them have died, but then I see a bunch of them all the time, so I'm not sure. They always go up here and then like jump off like they're trying to commit suicide. Reminds me of that movie where all those people are jumping off the roof. I don't know. <laughs> oh, I also, I don't know if I showed this. There was this building right there, and I didn't like it, so I moved it up to here and actually made it, like, to where it can be used. Um, like, obviously we're not going to use it. I'm not going to sit up here like, oh, look, some chickens. Oh, that reminds me. Look at that. You got Optifine going on. Look at this amazing terrain. See my bear trees? I got a bunch of leaves for some future stuff I don't have planned yet, but yeah. So, eat our baked potatoes. Much better than carrots. I was getting a little bored of carrots. So what I need to do is make quite a few adjustments. I need to replace all this with stone brick. I at least want to make the bottom block stone brick because I did that in my creative world and that's how those lamp post things that I've created, like they have stone brick as a floor and it looks just great. So and then I'm not sure but I kind of want to make like a design around the trees so perhaps like this but like nope but like all the way around the tree in cobblestone and like fill in the gaps and everything but make that in cobblestone and then do the border differently if that made any sense I'm not sure what I want to do I've never really built anything like this before so it will be pretty interesting to say the least ooh that could be a problem Hmm. Oh well. <laughs> so the only other thing is, I don't know, do I want to make this one, two, three, four, or do I want to make it one, two, three, which was what it was originally, but I had to move things around to get the trees to fit right. I think I want to make it three, because there's a wall here, and the staircase is are gonna be one wide um, or I could do a three wide staircase all the way down to the next level and hmm, that's gonna be interesting actually I should probably do ladders staircases might not work but I might hmm I might add something in here so I want to keep the shape of the building because I don't know really what else I would make it. Um, I know I, I don't really like making buildings this shape, but it's kind of a factory is what I'm going for. But not a gross factory, like a really nice factory. Like my plan is to make the floor all oak wood, make it really like warm and inviting, and put like dirt blocks with the tree or the sapling and that's my plan for this whereas my plan for the outside is going to be like stone brick with like the cobblestone maybe some glowstone or something would look nice if I can get it um, and like I said I'll probably just do that off camera and get some supplies for next time um, I don't know honestly 
I think this building's going to look really nice, though. I just need to decide what I want to do with this area. Hmm. Well, I'm going to think about that for a while. And we'll get back to it maybe next episode. Or if I can collect enough of what I'm trying to collect. Spoiler alert. Not really. I'm not going to spoil it. Maybe I am. Um, if I can collect enough of what I'm trying to collect, I will build the contraption that I'm thinking of. Um, and that's all I'm going to say. On that note, um, sorry, I was <laughs> looking at my chest and stuff. And we also need to do an entrance to town here. I'm not sure how to do that. But I want to change this path to gravel for one. And then I want to make it look nice. I want to get rid of this cave stuff. It's all holy and gross looking. Oh, that's nice. It's over there. Oh, birch. That's a weird tree. That's gigantic. It's like four trees melded together. Hmm. And that is a nice hill. Wow. Look at that. It's like a dome of sand. If only that was... Oh, I forgot about that one. I've been tearing these little farm things down. Ooh, I don't like this either. Um, anyways, I've been tearing these little farm things down. Oh, wow, there's potatoes here. So that I can get more wood easily without doing anything and because we have our little farm in the middle of town and I don't really need these anymore um, so I've been tearing them down I'll tear it down a bit later For now I'm kinda scouting out certain things our horses are doing good they're doing good Oh, missed. Oh well. Didn't really hurt us. But I would love to... Get this built. At least by next episode or before next episode. Um, I'm not really sure what to do though. Like I said, I don't, I'm not good at structures, so that's where I'm confused, because what I'm thinking of may end up being just a box, which is not good. That's never good. But, yeah. I feel like this episode is just a bunch of running around, speaking about future projects, and things I'm not sure on how to do so yeah <laughs> that's pretty much what I'm doing so I just need some advice I would say on what I should do for the tree farm should that be built on camera should I use ladders should I use stairs stairs would be a lot harder but I mean, you know what I might be able to do with stairs I might be able to go down using one wide staircases and come around that would work and then go down again on the next level and come around because what I'm aiming for is I want the doorway that I was talking about earlier to be in the same place on each level and pretty much like have oak here and then right below it have spruce and right below that have birch and on and on and on well not really that's pretty much it <laughs> but you get the picture so I'm not quite sure I think the staircase would look good but I'm not really sure how I would do it either like maybe 
put like cobblestone walls or something between it. Hmm. It's quite the interesting thought, to say the least. I'll have to test it out on the creative world so that I know exactly what type of staircase to use, I guess, would be what I'm talking about. Hmm. Yeah, so, anyways, <sighs> I just need some advice, I think, like, what should I do? What do you think would look best? It's really up to you. You comment on this video and tell me what you think would look best, and I'll take it into consideration. Um, yeah, I think I'm actually, I do have cobble good. I'm going to show you guys what I was talking about. So I want to fill that in. Fill that in. I might even... not sure. This might not be exactly what I meant. I have to do even more. And... fill that in. How did I do this? Oh! Wow! Dang. Yeah, I think that's what I did. Okay. Well, I'll do that. Just in case I do that again, because it wouldn't surprise me. Okay. Okay. Actually, that looks about right. For what I was thinking. Do that to each of the trees and then surround them with a different material. Let's do this. I probably could have kept this staircase here. Oh no, I couldn't have. Uh, like that, like that, like that, like that. That was a weird noise I made. <laughs> okay. I think that's it. Yeah, they're all on different levels, um, which I liked. This one looks a lot shorter, even though it's only two blocks of wood, but that one looks like so much shorter for some reason. I don't know if it's because it's so high. Like, it's high up in the air, but it just it looks so much shorter. It's kind of bothering me a little. <laughs> I don't know if that's that's just how birch is. It kind of looks a lot shorter than most of the other trees. You don't really see a birch tree that looks tall in this game. Nope. Yeah, it's like that. Like this and like that. Like this and that. Uh, okay. A little work here. And what material would look nice around that? Hmm. It's a good question. What I like about it is if you look at the leaves, it looks like the cobblestone sticks out farther than the leaves. Which I think is really cool. Or at least it it looks like that to me. Like I don't know. It doesn't look like it up close, but like when you're back here it looks like cuz you can see the defined line of the cobblestone and it's just like it sticks out more to me so I think that looks cool I almost just want to do that for that one. Oh, that might look good just in general let's see ooh I might have found it That might be it. And then fill the rest in with something different. I think that'll look good. Um, what looks good with stone brick? Honestly. Like, lots of things look good with stone brick, but what would look good in this context? Like, with the wood and the trees. I could almost just make it out of leaves. Hmm. 
I'm gonna try that. This will be the last thing we do in this episode. And it's gonna be awesome, or it's gonna be terrible. I mean, I've never really made a building out of leaves, but I have a lot of them. I prefer oak leaves to any other kind. I might be able to use oak leaves and, um, not stone, uh, spruce wood. That might look good. Like, not actual wood, but the... Cut this out. Um, no, not that. I think that layer needs to stay. Well, no, I can cut this out. Just keep it like that. There we go. The thing I like about the oak leaves is you can't see through them. So they're almost like a solid block. Hmm. That kind of looks cool, though. Not gonna lie. It could be a cool build. And then make. Ooh. I wonder. I can make this, like, out of stone brick. Do the leaves here. And then do, like, a darker wood block. I think. Let's see. Okay, I lied. This will be the last thing we do. I just want to check it out. See if it looks good. I know it's kind of a weird combination. I'm not trying to go for normal, so. Like that. Okay. Alright. See, from here, that looks awesome. To me, at least. I don't know. I'm sure it doesn't look, like, super cool to everyone, so. But, this is fun for me, fun for you. I'm supposed to have fun with it, so, you know, I gotta have fun with it. Okay, I wanna check something, though. How did I do the leaves exactly? So, I did... This has to be one, two, three, four... That's four, five, six. Does the floor count as one? Yeah, it does. Okay. So that's seven. I don't want to keep it even. So one, two, three, four. One, two, three, one, two, one. Okay. I can do that. I probably don't have enough wood for that, but I can do some of it. I might have enough wood. Who knows? Okay, so this is one, two, three, four, three, two, one, two, um, two, three. Okay, this one's gonna hurt. Is that it? I think that's it. Okay, let's see. Final product? Maybe. Oop, wrong dirt block. Hmm. I don't know. I don't like that as much as I thought I would. But I might like it with leaves. Just because it kind of adds some texture to it. And I might... I think that's a good idea, actually. The spruce leaves... You can't see through either. Is it... Can you see through any of them? Or am I just crazy? Is it those ones you can see through? Or is it jungle leaves? Jungle leaves are thick, aren't they? I don't know. I think for this one, I'll go with oak. Oak leaves, oak leaves. Spruce leaves, spruce leaves. Oak leaves, oak leaves, again. I think that'll look cool. And they'll all have different pattern to them, too. Which is cool. But 
definitely I, I don't like the spruce wood like I thought I would um, it looks alright but it's not it doesn't look good with the green I don't think hmm well anyways for now I think I'll end the episode and I'll do a little work on this and decide what I like and by next time I'll at least have the front of this done and I'm gonna try to have the frame of it done um, in the stone brick because that's what I want to do so anyways thanks for watching hope you enjoyed the episode leave me a like or a comment telling me what you want me to do I'll put it in because in if I could talk I'll take it into consideration because you are the best feedback in the world <sighs> thanks guys see you next time bye bye